Welcome. It's another edition of From the Barstool. I'm Barry Diamond, and with me, John Young. Hi, John. Howdy. Hey, you thank doing? you very much for uh, for stopping in. Thank you for having me, sir. Appreciate, I appreciate it. it. Stephenville, Texas boy. I am. I'm from <laughs> Stephenville, Texas, born and raised. And you've been playing guitar since like 14, age yes, 14? Yes, sir. Writing yeah. from age 14? I, I started too? writing about age 14. Um, really picked up the guitar maybe just a little bit earlier than that. But really, that's when I kind of settled into to doing what I enjoy doing, which right. is writing music. Very cool. Is there a song that you still play today that was like one of the first songs that you ever wrote? No, there isn't. And, it, and it's, it's one of those deals. I was explaining this to someone the other day. Uh, it's kind of like looking back at your high school yearbook. You see pictures right. and you, you say, wow, that sure was fun. And then you look, see another one and you go, oh my gosh, I can't believe I was doing that. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> but, you know, uh, in this industry, every little step that you take towards doing, being better and, and doing better things with music is, is a step in the right direction right so right. you know even if they're just hokey songs it doesn't matter it's it's all about finding out who you are and discovering yourself yeah do you remember the first song you ever wrote uh i really don't <laughs> very cool you, you well see you've written so many songs. i've written then. i've written a bunch and i've had uh my original bands were rock and roll bands right so those songs are a little bit different and I, I just honestly, I, I don't even really remember what would be the first one. I think there was probably like three or four that came out very, right. very close together. They were very simple, just little little songs. Right. Very <laughs> cool. Well, uh, we're going to get John to play. We're going to kind of kick this thing off. Uh, is there a song that uh, whenever you're uh, you're uh, performing live that you get up, you're like, man, I can't wait till, till I get to play this song? Uh, yes, uh, there is. There's one off my new record called Leap of Faith that I really enjoy a lot. Uh, I wrote it the week that I quit my full-time job as a plumber to become a full-time musician. Oh, awesome. Yeah. And it's, you know, it's, it's a very special song. I wrote it to my wife. It's kind of uh, it's, it's called leap of faith and it's just about taking that first step into the unknown and, you know, just doing it, going for it. Very cool. Let's do it. All right. This is called leap of faith. Here's John Young. I dream of life untethered from this sinking ship I'm on Living right where I belong next to you Oh darling, let's invest in a little happiness And leave behind the rest and start anew Cause I'll be there for you if you want me to behind and get away If you want me to I can carry you to all of our tomorrows of today Oh, our life is but a journey Would you say we go and take a leap of faith Let's throw out all the maps and slip into the cracks. America, you are my strangest friend. Cause what the hell's a mortgage worth when you're six feet in the dirt? Life is more than work, live it true. Cause I'll be there for you if you want me to. Behind and get away. If you want me to, I can carry you to all the bar tomorrow's or today. Oh, our life is but a journey. Would you say we go and take a leap of faith? Want me to? I can't. 
carry you to long far tomorrow's of today. Oh, our life is but a journey. Would you say we go and take a leap of faith? Take a leap of faith. Take a leap of faith. Woo. All right, very nice. Leap Thank of faith. Thank you so much. Leap of faith. John Young. <laughs> very nice now is that off the new album relic that's off the album relic yes sir very nice now you had an album out before that as well i did that, that did pretty well for you too. it really did do well uh that was uh, ashes of dreams of fire was the name of that record and i had a single off that one called let our living grow that i think made it to number 52 on the texas regional radio charts. Awesome. very yeah. cool very cool uh tell everybody where they can find you on social media so they can go there and take a look uh, if you look me up on uh facebook you can find the band uh under the john young and uh i put the on there because there is a white rapper out of florida named john young as well wonderful yeah and me and him compete for uh who's uh, higher on higher on the google images but he uh i had to do that just to kind of you know dif differentiate between the two of us and right. You can find me on Twitter. Uh, it's John Young TX Music is my uh, handle. And that one, I believe, let's see. Uh, and I am on Instagram as well. But uh, those are the, the main ones. Is there one that you like better over the other ones? <laughs> I, I don't <laughs> Is know. Is it so hard nowadays? It's getting, it's getting <laughs> difficult. And, you know, it's in, in these day, this day and age, you really have to be into social media. And I... Just have a hard time getting into it as much right. as I should. And my right. wife always gets on to me you know, right. for, for not uh, posting what I'm supposed to be posting. But <laughs> it's just, it's so foreign to me sometimes. But I, I think I like Facebook a little better than, than most of them. Right. Very cool. Now, you do a lot of writing. You've been writing since uh, since you were a kid. Yes, sir. Uh, is, there, is there one that you wrote that you're like, man, I, I want to get that on an album, but I'm going to wait for just a second for the right time to come <laughs> along or are you one that's like man i really like that i gotta get that to the people as soon as i can uh with with this little section of my career i pretty well everything that i put on albums is uh you know what what i really like right. so i i make sure to, to put out the ones that i really enjoy a lot right. and I, but i have tons of songs that are, are you know three quarters of the way finished and that i definitely they'll, they'll be on albums coming out for right sure. right but, is that is that sometimes hard <coughs> it, to, it, to to get that one finished? And, it you know, can be. Yeah. You know, it's so funny because some songs can come out in ten minutes and right. they can be fantastic. Some songs can take years. You know, I mean, to, right. to really get it finished and and polished the way that you want it. And I've had songs that I'll I'll play parts of for a while and then I'll go back and I'll finish it out and then it just totally makes sense. Right. Do you use the wife as a sounding board? I do. I do. And I, I like to keep uh, some of this secret from her until I'm ready to show her <laughs> just so I don't get any uh, negative feedback on it. Try to try to make sure what I'm showing her is what I'm going to present. Right. <laughs> now you got the new album out, Relic. Can they get yes, it? Like, can they get it today? It is available on all. Uh, so I, I, anywhere you get your MP3s, uh, right. iTunes, Amazon, um, basically all, the, all of them. And then the uh, it is available on Spotify. Both albums are on Spotify. And you can buy it from my website, which is www.thejohnyoung. There's no H in John. That's right. J-O-N. J-O-N. Yeah, yes, so sir. go by and check it out. Uh, what do you say we talk about the single? I'm ready okay. for the single. Tell me a little bit about, about how this one came about. So this whole album, basically, we kind of had the idea that uh, we wanted to make a record that was about the disposable nature of humanity. Uh, and I'm from Stephenville, Texas. Uh, I've watched a lot of my, my childhood memories kind of get bulldozed over. <laughs> There's a, and gentrification is happening everywhere, and I understand the need for it, but, you know, they come in and they, they knock down a building that means something to the locals right. and then put a shopping center there that within 10 years looks like garbage. Right. So I, I've watched several, several things that I loved as a child just get bulldozed and, you know, replaced, and... <clears throat> Rubble and Relics is my, my current radio single, and it's about a little record shop that existed in Stephenville that was called Impact Sound. Impact Sound was there for about 10 years, and from the time I was a little kid, I, I really enjoyed going in there, had a, a great relationship with the owner. Um, every time I would go in there, he would make sure to, to take care of me and, 
if I liked a band, next time I would come in, he would have the T-shirt, he'd have the CD, he'd have a DVD, <laughs> or, or back in then, I think it was a VHS. But right. we, we, you know, we had a really good relationship. Well, Hastings moved to town. They came into town, and we were all excited at first. Well, come to find out, Hastings was not excited to exist in the same shopping center as Impact Sound. Ah. So they talked to the owner, and one thing led to another, and the owner didn't renew the contract for the lease wow. on Impact Sound. So when Impact Sound went out of business, uh, they basically, they had very few options and they, they just kind of went out of business. And it was a big hit for a lot of us that grew up with that place and really loved the old record shop vibe, the mom and pop store. Um, so I actually, I wrote Rubble and Relics the week that Hastings went out of business. I was ah. remembering back, you know, years ago right. when all of that had gone down and it, it really kind of hit home that you know, they were kind of getting a little taste of their own medicine. <laughs> <laughs> it happened, didn't it, it? It did, it did. Yes, sir. And I, I mean, I, not to say I, I didn't enjoy Hastings as well, but didn't have a whole lot of options in Stephenville, Texas. <laughs> yeah, I understand <laughs> yes, perfectly. <sir. laughs> All right, so let, let's do it. <clears throat> Here is John Young. This is Rubble and Relic. the little screen in their hands I miss back when whole albums were good when my heroes stood for something and we marked where they stood it's hard to sit by and watch it wither away but got their bulldoze in my memories almost every day turning us into rubble and relics bought what they were selling now they're selling us too we're just black and red and charts of loss and profit. I went the old and in with the new. Make way for the chosen, save a really go to. Shop went under when the chain stores arrived. Nobody wept when they met with their end. But a few of us remember just how cool it had been. I miss the days when we'd sneak out to show, singing songs of teenage fury just to piss off our folks. Now we look at the world and all that I see are the cold eyes of the future inside a machine. Turning us into rubble and relics Bought what they were selling, now they're selling us too We're just black and red and jogs are lost and profit Out with the old and in with the new Make way for the chosen, save a really go to Really go to We want to thank John Young for being on the program today. Don't forget to look him up on the internet. Just go to thejohnyoung.com. That's J-O-N. Want to thank him for being here today from the Barstool.